Latent heat is thermal energy released or absorbed, by a body or a thermodynamic system, during a constant temperature process—usually a first-order phase transition. Latent heat can be understood as heat energy in hidden form which is supplied or extracted to change the state of a substance without changing its temperature. Examples are latent heat of fusion and latent heat of vaporization involved in phase changes, i.e., a substance condensing or vaporizing at a specified temperature and pressure. The term was introduced around 1762 by British chemist Joseph Black. It is derived from the Latin latere to lie hidden. Black used the term in the context of calorimetry where a heat transfer caused a volume change in a body while its temperature was constant. In contrast to latent heat, sensible heat is a heat transfer that results in a temperature change in a body. Usage The terms sensible heat and latent heat refer to types of heat transfer between a body and its surroundings, they depend on the properties of the body. Sensible heat is sensed or felt in a process as a change in the body's temperature. Latent heat is heat transferred in a process without change of the body's temperature, for example, in a phase change solid, liquid, gas. Both sensible and latent heats are observed in many processes of transfer of energy in nature. Latent heat is associated with the change of phase of atmospheric or ocean water, vaporization, condensation, freezing or melting, whereas sensible heat is energy transferred that is evident in change of the temperature of the atmosphere or ocean, or ice, without those phase changes, though it is associated with changes of pressure and volume. The original usage of the term, as introduced by Black, was applied to systems that were intentionally held at constant temperature. Such usage referred to latent heat of expansion and several other related latent heats. These latent heats are defined independently of the conceptual framework of thermodynamics. When a body is heated at constant temperature by thermal radiation in a microwave field, for example, it may expand by an amount described by its latent heat with respect to volume or latent heat of expansion, or increase its pressure by an amount described by its latent heat with respect to pressure. Latent heat is energy released or absorbed by a body or a thermodynamic system during a constant temperature process. Two common forms of latent heat are latent heat of fusion melting and latent heat of vaporization boiling. These names describe the direction of energy flow when changing from one phase to the next, from solid to liquid, and liquid to gas. In both cases the change is endothermic, meaning that the system absorbs energy. For example, when water evaporates, energy is required for the water molecules to overcome the forces of attraction between them. The transition from water to vapor requires an input of energy. If the vapor then condenses to a liquid on a surface, then the vapor's latent energy absorbed during evaporation is released as the liquid's sensible heat onto the surface. The large value of the enthalpy of condensation of water vapor is the reason that steam is a far more effective heating medium than boiling water, and is more hazardous. Meteorology <inaudible> <inaudible> In meteorology, latent heat flux is the flux of heat from the Earth's surface to the atmosphere that is associated with evaporation or transpiration of water at the surface and subsequent condensation of water vapor in the troposphere. It is an important component of Earth's surface energy budget. Latent heat flux has been commonly measured with the Bowen ratio technique, or more recently since the mid-1900s by the Jonathan Beaver method. History The English word latent comes from Latin latens, meaning lying hidden. The term latent heat was introduced into calorimetry around 1750 when Joseph Black, commissioned by producers of Scotch whiskey in search of ideal quantities of fuel and water for their distilling process, to studying system changes, such as of volume and pressure, when the thermodynamic system was held at constant temperature in a thermal bath. James Prescott Joule characterized latent energy as the energy of interaction in a given configuration of particles, i.e. a form of potential energy, and the sensible heat as an energy that was indicated by the thermometer, relating the latter to thermal energy. <laughs> <laughs> Specific latent heat 
A specific latent heat L expresses the amount of energy in the form of heat Q required to completely affect a phase change of a unit of mass m, usually 1 kg, of a substance as an intensive property L equals Q m L equals frac Q m Intensive properties are material characteristics and are not dependent on the size or extent of the sample. Commonly quoted and tabulated in the literature are the specific latent heat of fusion and the specific latent heat of vaporization for many substances. From this definition, the latent heat for a given mass of a substance is calculated by Q equals m L display style Q equals m L where Q is the amount of energy released or absorbed during the change of phase of the substance in kJ or in BTU. M is the mass of the substance in kilogram or in lb, and L is the specific latent heat for a particular substance kJ kilogram minus one or in BTU lb minus one, either LF for fusion or LV for vaporization. Topic. Table of specific latent heats The following table shows the specific latent heats and change of phase temperatures at standard pressure of some common fluids and gases. <laughs> specific latent heat for condensation of water in clouds The specific latent heat of condensation of water in the temperature range from minus 25 degrees Celsius to 40 degrees Celsius is approximated by the following empirical cubic function L water T equals 2500.8 minus 2.36 T plus 0.0016 T two minus zero point zero 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 six T three J per gram Display style L underscore text water T equals two thousand five hundred point eight to two point three six T plus zero point zero zero one six T carrot two minus zero point zero 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 six T carrot three tilde text J per gram where the temperature T display style T is taken to be the numerical value in degree C. For sublimation and deposition from and into ice, the specific latent heat is almost constant in the temperature range from 40 degrees Celsius to 0 degrees Celsius and can be approximated by the following empirical quadratic function L ice T equals 2834.1 minus 0.29 T minus 0.004 T 2 J per gram display style L underscore text ice T equals 2834.1 to 0.29 T 0.004 T carrot 2 tilde text J per gram topic variation with temperature or pressure As the temperature or pressure rises to the critical point the LHOV falls to zero. Topic See also Bowen ratio Eddy covariance flux Eddy correlation Eddy flux Sublimation physics Specific heat capacity Enthalpy of fusion Enthalpy of vaporization